What's up, YouTube? It's Terabyte One here. I'm doing a review on the Nike Pro Combat Hypercool. This is the uh, NFL Charges version. So, um, yeah, I'll just get started. Uh, basically, a Hypercool shirt is for extremely hot weather. Well, it doesn't have to be extremely hot. It just has to be hot. Or, you know, this shirt could be used from, you know, places from 80 degrees from... A good 60 degrees to 80 or even higher than that because I know some of you guys play in the fall and summer it'll be hot but now hyper warm stuff has to be I would use it for 50 and below but then again that's me but you know hyper cool you can use this this is a football shirt you can use it for training or you can use it for or you can use it for just in games, you can use it for games and training. I use the shirt when I work out sometimes. But, um, you know, yeah. So, I'll show you a cool few good things I saw about it. The Nike sign on the side right here. There's not one right there. And then up here, it says Dry Fit and NFL on field. The reason why I got Chargers because my school is Chargers and it looks sexy. I just want to point that out. And it has a lot of ventilation zones. <laughs> up through the side of the body right here you can see that the ventilation zones even down through here and then through here if you flip it over here's what I like as a ventilation zone and the Nike football type with the sign I have on elite socks and stuff like that and the NFL sign so I thought that was pretty cool. Now this on I got I you I get all my Nike stuff from Nike.com. I don't go into stores. I haven't been in a store for stuff like this in probably I haven't like gone to a store for like a haul equipment for about a season now. I just get everything from Nike.com because they have everything I want except gloves that I wanted. Nike, if you're listening, you might not see this video, but get more vapor carbon gloves and more vapor jets it's a shame but yeah about the shirt dry fit is um sweat wicking material just now when i'm in my dry fit if you if it was raining then it won't keep you like extremely dry but i mean it would on some nike shirts on like the dry filled max shirts it would just slide right off but i'll have i'll have a review on one of those but it has flat lock seams, so we can't fit the flat lock seams all throughout the shirt down here. And then on the back, on the back of the shoulder. And also has a ventilation system up here. And just all around the shirt and around the NFL side. Now on Nike.com, I got this for about 30 bucks. Maybe even less. Maybe even, I got this from 25 to 35 bucks. Now in the stores. This might be 50, not compression hypercools, or 50. Now, maybe fitted ones I've seen for $45 and below. But, you know, something like that. So, yeah. How to clean this, how I just do it how I basically, you can either hand wash it, throw it in the washer on the delicate cycle, put it on extra delicate, but it's the same thing. Delicate, you know, regular laundry detergent, don't use any fabric softeners, anything like that, or liquid bleach. Just use detergent, Tide or whatever. And you can hand wash it with some soap and water and then let it air dry. But I don't let my Nike stuff air dry because it takes too dang long for it to do that. So it takes a while it takes a while for it to air dry. So I don't I don't do that stuff. But I just throw them in the, throw it in a dryer on regular. So anyway you two, that's my review on the Nike Pro Combat Hypercool. Top NFL Chargers and peace out.